I heard this. They made a mistake. They were not supposed to leave. It was an error. They were not supposed to go. Before I share this word, let us pray. Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you for your word. Thank you for your faithfulness. Thank you for your grace, your love, and your mercy. Continue to take the glory and the praise in Jesus' name. Amen. This prophetic word is coming to someone. At a time when you're feeling isolated and you're feeling alone. You're feeling like the people that matter to you, the people that were important to you, are no longer there. Most of them left you because they had given up on you. They gave up on you feeling like nothing good can come out of you. They gave up on you feeling like you were not the good choice. They were deceived into thinking that you are not a good choice for them. But now I see a lot of regret. I see someone that is sitting somewhere and really regretting. Thinking to themselves that they would not have made the decision so fast. But you see, each time someone makes the decision to leave you, God always fills up that space with someone better. That is why we are always advised never to burn bridges. Because one day you might want to use it and you will discover that there is no way to go back. You see, when you want to live somebody's life, just live in a peaceful way. If you want to cut off from someone, cut off in a peaceful way so that when you need help with their assistance, you can easily go back to them. You see, life sometimes can be so predict unpredictable. Life can be so unpredictable. And the same people that leave you or the people you're leaving might be the same people God has placed in your future to be your divine helpers. God will not come to teach you how to treat people because he has already given you the manual in his word. He says, treat them with love. Accept them with love. If you want to cut off from someone, do so in a peaceful way. Just like the Bible tells us about Abraham and Lot. They separated in a very peaceful way, though there was a fight between their workers. But they made sure that their separation was peaceful. Then Lord got into a lot of trouble and Abraham could still come and save him. Maybe this word is two-sided. God is teaching us to leave places peacefully. We think that those who left in an unpleasant way will regret the move that they made. Because he is lifting and raising you to a point where many will come to ask for help. Many will come to ask for assistance. Do you believe in the word of the Lord? Believe that God is lifting you this season. In Jesus' name. Father, thank you for your word and this assurance. At the end of the day, Lord, take all the glory and the praise. In Jesus' name. Amen. Please do like, comment, and share. May the Lord bless you. I love you. Shalom.